friends, I am so excited to keep talking with all of you guys about the armor of God. So we've talked about the belt of truth and we've talked about the breastplate of righteousness. And this week, I want to talk about the shoes of peace. Now the shoes of peace just like the rest of the armor of God, is based off of the armor that the Roman soldiers used to wear in Jesus' time. Now the shoes that the Roman soldiers wore weren't normal sandals like other people wore back then. They were specially made to help them win in battle. Now have you guys seen something like this before? A little tack, how it's got that really sharp spike on the end that can go on the inside of something? Well, the Roman soldiers' shoes had tacks and spikes all on the bottom of them. That way, no matter where they stood, nothing could push them or nothing could move them. They were strong and sturdy because the spikes dug into the ground. And that's what God's peace is supposed to do for us. When we walk in the peace of God, no matter what comes at us, nothing can move us, nothing can shake us or force us to go all over the place because God's peace keeps us sturdy and stable. The peace of God helps us to make sure that we're never moved. You know what? We should actually look at an example of this. So these are two of my friends. Hi guys. And they're both gonna go through a lot of different things in their lives. And she's gonna go through it wearing her shoes of peace. But he's gonna go through it without his shoes of peace. And so we're gonna see what it's like walking with your shoes of peace or without your shoes of peace in your life. Okay, so I've got this super ultra mega wind blaster and we're gonna use this on our friends. So in our lives, we're gonna have all kinds of different emotions that are gonna try to make us feel different ways like angry or sad or frightened. And we can have those emotions and feel them, but we shouldn't let them control us. Kind of like this wind blower. <laughs> Now, my friend felt the wind on the wind blower, but she didn't let it move her. Just like with our emotions, as long as you're wearing your shoes of peace, nothing can move you from where you're supposed to be. But if you're not wearing your shoes of peace, you can be moved by any kind of emotion that comes at you. <laughs> And you're not gonna have any control over your life because you're letting your emotions move you all over the place. And that's not a good place to be. That's why we need to stand strong in the peace that God gives us. Now the shoes of peace don't just help us to stand strong when things try to move us. They also help us to walk through all kinds of crazy situations in our lives, you know? All kinds of things can try to come and cause us to slip up or cause all kinds of crazy stuff to happen, honestly. And if we try to walk through those things on our own, We'll end up tripping and falling in life when we didn't have to. But if we walk with our shoes of peace on, no situation can stop us. So I want all of you to walk in the peace that God offers you. Put on your full armor of God and live the life that God has planned for you. I'll see all of you guys next time. Bye.